Let's kick things off with today's Hollywood wrap as we say hello to Peacock. Remember how much fun high school used to be? You believe that was like 30 years ago? You could say everything old is new again at NBC's brand new streaming service. Peacock, of course, named after the iconic logo, now looking to compete with Netflix, Hulu, Prime Video, Disney+, Plus, Apple TV+, Plus, and HBO Max. Are you excited? Definitely, I'm fired up. Yeah. They'll do it by mixing their iconic NBC Universal Library, which includes networks such as Bravo, E!, Sci-Fi, and USA, along with new content content like reboots of Saved by the Bell and Punky Brewster. Mom, you put on two different shoes. Haven't done that in a while. Still works. There will be two versions of Peacock, a free one and a paid one. The latter will give you access to the new original shows, including a new comedy with a familiar friend. I think we can learn a lot from each other, especially from me. David Schwimmer starring in the spy spoof Intelligence. All you have to do is connect. There's also the new sci-fi drama Brave New World with solo star Alden Ehrenreich and the new British thriller The Capture. I went from making millions to zero. Peacock also diving into the world of sports with new reality shows starring Olympic swimmer Ryan Lochte and racing legend Dale Earnhardt Jr. There's also kid shows, late night shows, and even new movies like this psych reunion film. Gus? Can you give me some chewy? For customers of NBC's parent company, Comcast, Premium Peacock is free. But for the rest of us, we'll have to decide if we want to pay for yet another streaming service. Peacock lands July 15th. And that's today's Hollywood Wrap. Thanks so much for stopping by. Hit the subscribe button to stay in the loop on the latest celebrity and entertainment news. And check out CelebrityPage.com for more Hollywood headlines.